just did cocaine on a night out Eyes wide open, dilated, but he's fine now And if his father ever finds out, then he'd probably knock his lights out Gets a little messy in heaven Gets a little messy in heaven so we have made it to Gaydon, uh, the British Motor Museum, which is an awesome venue um, for events like this. And yeah, um, we'll have a look through the car park later, more than likely, because there is some cool stuff out here, including this Astra that we parked in front of, which is super cool with the, uh, the crossfade and then the white wheels, super clean. And yeah, there's some really cool cars in the car park, but I'm really looking forward to this show, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, just went for these dickheads. Super strong start with the TSWs today. I'm assuming there's gonna be a fuck ton of Venoms here. But this thing is so cool. So cool. There's gonna be a lot of cars you see today where you're gonna go, my dad's, my dad had one of these on, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Then there's this Supra here as well. Very interesting. So it's, um, it's got an interesting dent there. It's a very interesting wrap. Is that wrapped carbon as well? I like the see-through bonnet. It's wrapped carbon. This is great. This is like peak max power. It's great. It's um. It's not even though. That's the best thing I've ever. Fuck yeah! Just in case you guys didn't know, he's a bugger. Base on board. What a sticker, mate. <laughs> So um, this is how you know we're here. Jesus Christ. Since 1901. My God. Holy shit. It's got the double stacked exhaust both side. That's so cool. So next to the poster car for the show today, we have this absolutely stunning E30, which is insane. It's so cool actually trying to talk a bit more and film a bit more of this video uh, than the last one. But this is so cool, really, really awesome. And obviously we have our courses, uh, Novas and Escorts everywhere and a random Mini for some reason. So um, Anarchy Garage are actually building a Corsa here in the show, which is so cool. Look, I haven't seen that car in so many years, it's so cool interesting not as interesting as this that is dedication holy shit dedication that and in today's episode of why is that here um and then to ask again i'm not you know holy shit what the fuck so andy has brought his hks um Skoda, is it a Fabia estate or an Octavia? It's an Octavia, right? He's brought his uh, his Octavia estate, which is super cool, and I fucking love it. Super fucking cool to see stuff like this here. I wasn't expecting it. Um, also, wasn't expecting to see the thing that haunts my nightmares. Um, or this, holy fuck. Holy shit. Talk about bling. My God, and he's got the sunroof open, the windows match, yo. Full sapia brown leather interior. Look at that. My goodness. This car is actual pornography. It's not, it shouldn't be here because it is pornography. Actual pornography. What the fuck? Our first tri spokes of the day. Tri spoke on in. Oh, so uh, here we have a one via. Is that right? Is it a one via when it's got the PS13 in front but the 240 back? That was a still 80. Says it there. Yeah, still 80. The one via is the other way around. It has the the, the PS13 rear end, but the S13 front end. But this is a still 80, which as you can tell by their Instagram username. Yeah. But it's on tri spoke, super cool, matching cars with Phil. Phil. Uh, and yeah, super clean. Uh, it should be a lot lower, but other than that, yeah, super sweet. I like this. Try spokes. Wide body Mark Three. Wide body Mark Two. 
I don't have the option to, to really film much here because of the uh, music, but this is my favorite car of the day. So here we have an angry Clio with some Rolls Royce doors. Mate, look at the fucking speakers. Crazy. It's got no brake lights either. Mental. Probably my eighth time seeing this car this year. But this is new and this is fucking awesome. If, uh, if you like Nissans, this isn't a Nissan, but it is a Nissan color. This is clean. So, um, I, I said a minute ago to the boys, the boys, I've never seen this many Renault 5s before. And then we've just walked across this line. Mental, fucking mental. So just off from uh, Renault 5 Row, as I'm gonna name it, I think that's a good name for it. There is three Cosez, lovely. And this absolute machine, which is awesome. I fucking love this car. There are some actual, there's some actual like really cool fucking MPVs being built for some reason. And this is just lovely, lovely. Just off from uh, Renault 5 Row and this wonderful Honda, we have uh, McDonald's car park. We have Geordie's S15. It is super fucking clean though. I fucking love Geordie's R33. It's the uh, Geordie's R33 got me into into the R33 a bit more because I was never really a fan. But yeah, TSW watch. It's definitely a statement. This car. But I like it. We're gonna try some weird Fanta flavors. So Alex went with uh, strawberry. What do you think? It's kind of good, but kind of weird. What, what do you mean by that? It tastes, it, just, it tastes like the old strawberry ribena. Really? Yeah. Intriguing. But yeah. Well, I mean, it's kind of what it is, isn't it? Yeah. At the end of the day. So Jacob's gone with peach. Why did you get peach? My fat half. He's missing Kirby. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of that? Hey, it's like peach. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys will be surprised. I went with grape, and it does in fact taste like grapes. We're making gra groundbreaking discoveries. <laughs> Ground groundbreaking Fanta reviews <laughs> on on the Steel OEM YouTube channel. Yeah, that's a good point. These were two pound each. Yeah, I'm keeping the can. Two pound each. So Alex is keeping the can. <laughs> Don't know if this is a real GTS, but it is a Dakar. Yeah, thanks, mate. Oh, sorry. It's, <laughs> this is a Dakar Yellow E92 oh, M3. Oh, for fuck's sake, fuck off. Is, is what, are you, what are you trying to show him? The transit van? It's the little BMW corner here, but this CRX is fucking lovely. Really? Just down from this CRX that's seen parked in disabled bays, you have another CRX that's seen parked in disabled bays. You have a Yaris that's seen parked in a disabled bay. You have a Fiesta. You're never going to guess it. That's seen parked over a disabled bay. Light him up, customs. Congrats on building a car in 11 days. You're seen parked in a disabled spot. We have the cleanest, cleanest Fiesta in the world. Recaro seats, the Momo steering wheel. Completely factory. XR2 Fiesta. Holy shit. And there's a lake that I wanted to throw Josh in. They're tucked. <laughs> Don't know why this is here, but this actually might be a GTS. It's again, sat on GTS wheels with a GTS wing. It's an M3 Comp. Close enough. Fucking mint, mate. We have a fucking insane line of Mercedes here. My God, full chrome monoblocks with the gold hardware. Mate, mental. Hell fucking yeah. This is fucking awesome. What the fuck? He's got the chopper and the roof box. Got the Ronal Aero, Ronal, are they turbo Aero? No, there's Aeros. 16 inch arrows, 
on the 9N2. Mate, that's banging. Fucking awesome. And a starlet. And that is sick. But that is fucking gnarly. Trust folks. We have uh, Max's Corsa, which is uh, insane. Wide body, five series, front lights. He's also got a Hurricane, which is not here. Here we have an A86, wait, no. Yes, we are tri-spoke hunting yet again with the MR2. This is super cool. I saw this again earlier in the year and it's just so fucking cool to see it, it shows. The Lamborghini Aventador that isn't here, isn't, shouldn't be here, is making noises. We don't care, we're going to look at this. And um, we're probably gonna wrap it up here soon. Um, the video that is. And I'm gonna end it not in here. Yeah, this is awesome. Super, super awesome trio of cars.